are you eating there? Tiff. Right there. Our child. But today is a very special day because we are bringing to you our f family car slash new off-roading car, I guess. But as you saw in the thumbnail, this vehicle is a very capable vehicle. Very, very damn capable. I was on the fence about getting the Forerunner, Tundra, or another Tacoma. Been a crazy couple of months, and uh, as you know, as you saw in one of our my previous videos, we are actually pregnant with our son. <laughs> We are seven months now, so it's going by extremely fast. So I decided to get something that I like and that is capable of doing anything that I was capable of doing with a Tacoma. But this one has mid, like a central lockers. I don't know how to call them. I guess like a central lock. It has four low. It has heated, cooled seats. Um, it's pretty much everything that we really need, honestly. Um, it is a big truck. It's a V8. <laughs> no, you're going to stretch it. <laughs> so it's a very nice vehicle that we have, right? Uh, it's a 2018. It's not new, but it looks exactly like the old one. I mean, like the new one. Um, I have no issues with the looks of it because all the new one has is just headlights, a uh, better grill, and uh, black wheels that's about it and it's a lexus it's a toyota product so it's gonna last us for as long as we take care of it properly of course so i'm gonna show you guys around the wife is gonna stay in here in the cooled uh ventilated seats here that we have so i'll showcase you uh you know the car how it looks how it stands as it is right now it's completely stocked from the motor tranny suspension interior exterior it's just uh, i guess an old lady had it and they traded it in for a jeep or whatever um and we got lucky with this uh, good price i would say for a lexus um they're actually going down in price which is a very good thing for us I couldn't be any happier, honestly. It's my tires and rims or my tires and wheels from the Toyota Tacoma fit perfectly on this. Once it's lifted, again, it's a stock suspension right now. Everything is stuck in this truck or SUV, whatever you want to call it. I call it the rig. No, okay, no. <laughs> this is going to be way better than the Tacoma, for sure, 100%. V8, 310 horsepower. Of course, to the crank, um, four-wheel drive with lockers, or, well, must be no front and rear lockers by themselves, but it has a central locker. Um, but we're just gonna go on here in some trails that we have behind our house, uh, which are not so crazy, but I mean, for what we're gonna use this vehicle for, which is like basic overland, nothing crazy, nothing like... Crazy. I'm just kidding. Thank you. What we're gonna be using this vehicle for is nothing crazy. Is that better? <laughs> I feel like this is a perfect vehicle for that. 
hence why we got this vehicle again i was looking at the forerunner but again i'm gonna have to re-gear uh if i want to go with bigger tires such as 35s i don't really have to re-gear on this because it's a v8 so win-win again it's nothing different from the 2023 or 2022 which that's the year that they changed you know quote unquote um it's nothing different from that why because it just needs to change the front grille the front headlights and black out the wheels the, these are the exact same wheels that come out in the premium package or in the other other packages and in the 2022 plus 25 g's less for a 2018 it has 70,000 miles on the clock ready to roll ready to roll out but yeah guys i mean i just wanted to showcase our new vehicle to the family this is a very special one because now we have our little one coming and he's going to be riding in this with us, going to trips, going to places that, you know, a basic Audi, a basic Corvette won't take us to. Um, but we're in, we're in a, we're in a dirt road right here. Trans, I mean, suspension, Jesus, it's beautiful. It's, there's some bumpy ass tracks right here. it like a boss to look at that wow this is this is the first time we've taken this vehicle off-roading I mean basic off-roading here you know it's, there's no like rock crawling anywhere here but it's basic off-roading and it's doing very very well so this is a point of return here. I mean, we can go further down, but I just wanted to showcase what this vehicle is pretty much capable of. And um, you guys are not even, you guys don't even know what this is going to be. This is going to be insane. It's going to be an insane build. I'm not going to cut any corners, you know. Uh, I mean, I don't know much of the interior that we can really do to this, but I mean, I really love the interior. It's, aside from one thing, the one thing that I hate about this okay you see all the climate control settings right this is the only settings that we have in the external part of the vehicle um, or the interior but in the external part of the, the the center console but we have to press this climate control button to get to the higher and lower the amount of you know pressure this thing is tossing out to you but that's my only really complaint that i have about this vehicle other than that uh it, it gives me great miles per gallon it's giving me right now 15 after refuel but i just refueled like yesterday and we're actually like out here and you know kind of pressuring it a little bit but other than that 15.5 and in reality it's average is 17.3 to the gallon so it's better than my tacoma honestly and with the V8, I'm pretty sure we can haul all that stuff that we're going to put on this. Um, oh, man, I, I just can't wait for you guys to see. It's going to be so, so good. And then we're going to have our son back there now. He's going to be enjoying the whole, the, you know, the whole thing with us now, which is going to be so insane. And I'm so excited. This one, I'm excited about, you know, apocalypse ready. I kind of want to have, you know, like... You'll see, you'll see within time. You'll freaking see because my vision is there and I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna achieve it pretty soon. And I am so excited and I can't wait to tag you guys along. Um, but yeah, I mean, this is it guys. 2018 Lexus GX 460 V8. What about a supercharger, huh? I'll leave you with that. Guys, I mean, if you guys wanna check one of these out, uh you know look them up they're all over the damn place and even the new ones are now starting to drop in price so we might get another one we don't know we'll see we'll figure it out but yeah this is going to be it for today's video guys if you enjoyed it please leave a thumbs up i would really truly appreciate that again our channel is going slowly but steadily so i'm so excited what the uh, steady you said steadily isn't it that a, that's not a word I don't know. I never heard that word before. Steadily. My wife is trying to autocorrect me, but I don't know. I don't know if it is steadily even a word. No. 
Okay, my wife says no. But anyway, guys, you drop the comments down below and let me know what we should do to this truck. Vehicle, SUV, whatever you guys want to call it. I call it whatever it is. I just say whatever it is. Car, vehicle, truck, rig, uh, SUV. So you name it. I'm just so excited that we have this because now we can go on long trips and we can actually go into the wilderness kind of not too crazy but you know a lot of things are going to come for this vehicle and all the other ones as well um but yeah guys um that's it pretty much so until next time peace out